What's up everyone? It's Mikhail Casanova, Hawaii's favorite YouTuber, back at you again with another banging episode of this channel. And uh, we're about to do this review of a game that is just, it's got a concept that's just insane. I mean, think about it. There are mechs, there's pizza. You put them together, and you've got Pizza Titan Ultra. The, the concept of this game is insane. I'm running around as a mech delivering pizzas. I mean, just, wow. You know, Team Breakfall just really came up with something that I never would have thought of. I never would have thought that would have worked, but it's, it's fun. It doesn't take itself seriously. It's basically a game, a game from my era where we didn't too much care about stories. We didn't take them seriously. And they were just arcadey, uh, thrill of your seat, type of experiences and it's just amazing to see another game come out that's like that and it came from the team team breakfall uh, to make something that's just so insane that it works so we're gonna get into this video review shout out to team breakfall for sending me a review code for this game I've enjoyed it I'm gonna show some footage of it if you're ready to do it I'm ready to do it let's do the damn thing and get this going So when it comes to video games these days, I have to be honest, I'm feeling burnt out with every game that's coming out taking itself ultra serious and going for the most realistic of graphics. You know, a cut, copy, and paste type of formula. Everyone seems to be going for in this day and age of gaming. It's tiring, honestly. When there's such a focus on realism and graphics over fun and originality. That's where Pizza Titan Ultra comes in. Team Breakfall decided to buck the trend of going after an ultra realistic game with state of the art graphics and instead decided to take two amazing things, mechs and pizza, and combine them into a game that's all about delivering pizza while avoiding baddies in a 10 story tall mech. Seriously, how can you go wrong with such a premise? It's insane and it works. Pizza Titan Ultra is a third person fast paced action platformer that has you going around delivering the galaxy's greatest pizza on various planets within the confines of a time limit per stage. Think Crazy Taxi minus the awesome Bad Religion soundtrack of about three songs. You're able to gather ingredients to make better pizza by having more toppings to add during a mini game when you deliver your pizza as well as the ability to perfectly or rather attempt to make a perfect pie slice. There are times when you will run into a random straggler wanting a pie and so you get to make and bake and all that jazz. So you probably want to know about the story. Well yeah there is a story and it's funny but ultimately we're not here for the story. But we're going to go in on the story right now. About five years ago there was a robot named Cheeseborg that was ruling the fast food scene with an iron fist with horrible food and ultimately got overthrown by Ultra Pizza. And he's none too happy about that. You have a motley crew with you that falls into the archetypes of the leader who's Tanya, the cool guy Zack, the mechanic Ace, and the new pilot and slash recruit who's you and many more and you'll run into wild and crazy characters inspired by anime and old 80s and 90s pop culture like the star wars text scroll planet man who's actually captain planet bob ross i mean ross roberts actually and vagoku who's basically goku and vegeta of dragon ball z and more it's all insane and zany and I love it. The layout of the game has you going through levels in a mission based format of which you will be grinding for more money and trying to combat the timer to deliver more pizza. Battle cheese board baddies, picking up money and timer clocks to gain more time, all the while trying to avoid destroying buildings and apartments as, they, as that takes away from your money. Finding ingredients are often part of some mission that wants you to find anywhere from three to all five toppings in various other mission based objectives. The controls are very simple in that you use the left analog 
to run around and being able to jump, attack, dodge, roll, sprint, hover, and more. The layout of the controls are very comfortable and easy to get used to, and the camera angle is slanted at an isometric angle, but it just works. And the OST is pretty chill, and the title theme is so good and catchy that it's stuck in my head on repeat. So what are the downsides of this game? Well other than the length, I really can't complain about anything in this game because I just really enjoyed that this game makes effort to be fun while having fun and not taking itself too seriously and honestly I greatly appreciate that. All in all, I think that Pizza Titan Ultra is a phenomenal game that is such a true joy to play both in bite sized sessions and in long playthroughs and it's also a lot of fun to stream and definitely a fun game if you're having friends over for a pizza party get it pizza party or by yourself pizza titan ultra is definitely a game that is casanova approved so go out and buy this game now that being said i want to thank you guys for coming through for this review i had a hell of a lot of time a hell of a lot of fun actually sorry i flubbed that up um, I'm hungry. You know what I? You know what I think? This is what I think I should do. I, I need to order some pizza. Let me. I got my phone. Let me order some right now. Okay, it's ordered. It's on the way. See, this is the thing. I wish gaming would go back to being this way when it was just arcadey when it was fun it didn't take itself seriously they came up with the most wacky zany type of things you could think of and just throw them at you and it's a, a very fun experience nowadays you got games either trying to be simulations or they're focusing so much on realism to the point where they're just not as fun and that's why i appreciate exactly what team breakfall did with this game because they did something that's original, that's fun, that's a callback to the 80s and 90s. I mean, look at the art style, the, the way that the characters act, the way they talk, the way they look. It's definitely a callback to the 80s and the early 90s. And it's just, it's such a fun, organically fun experience. And I'm glad that they did that. So thank you, Team Breakfall, for making a game like this. And hopefully we can get more games like this. Uh, from you in the future and also from other companies take note that this is something we need to have back in the gaming industry not everything needs to be realistic looking. not everything needs to have you know this, this dreary dark tone I need stuff like this just to kick back and have fun and I'm super glad again thank you team breakfall for making this game now I want you guys to tell me what you think. If you like this video and if you like the game Pizza Titan Ultra, why don't you tell me what you think down in the comment section below. And if you haven't already, make sure you go to MikhailCasanova.com. That way you can stay up to date on all the latest reviews, full reviews. I don't even have videos for up right now. It's also the hub, the central hub for the Casanova podcast, as well as the area where you can find just about everything that I'm doing. So. That being said, thank you guys for watching. Thank you again to Team Breakfall. And yeah, you know how we end these videos all the time. I always say, deuce is wild, too sweet, be the elite. And I catch you on the next one.